Hey, I shall in this video demonstrate the use of the analysis tool list unique values. I have here open QGIS with a land use map of the Leirfossen watershed area in Trondheim. The land use map in Trondheim is called AR short for ARIA resources and this comes in various version and the number 5 means that this is the version adapted to scales in 1 to 5000. Here all land use categories are shown with one single symbol. Everything is green but not everything is forest. So what I want to find out is how many land use categories do I have within this watershed and do I have all land use categories that is supposed to be in this RR5 dataset. And to find the answer to this question I use a tool from the analysis tool folder called list unique values. Here I need to enter the input layer and as I have marked this already this pop-ups automatically here and I need to select one or more target fields. So the land use categories are listed in the field areal type. So I select that one, click OK and then I don't need any layer for this and it's okay to have an output file after running algorithm. So I just click run and this go super fast and it gives you the answer in this log here. Here it says that the total of unique values is 10 and here it lists the unique values. This is also available from the HTML report here. So you can double click on it and opens a web browser with the same information, the total unique values and the unique values here. Then do I have all the classes I expect to have? Then I need to go to a source listing all the available areal. And this is one of the places I can get this information. Here at least all the area resource types and it's actually 11 of them and the one I'm missing is the one representing glaciers. There is no glacier within Trondheim. 